At the beginning, we see a boy named Will, who comes to school daily, but today he sees a girl in his school whom he has never seen before. He also follows her, but then Will's sister stops him. That girl had disappeared from there for such a long time. Will runs after her. Now that girl sees him on her school bus, whose scarf was left in the bus while getting down, Will keeps it with him. Now, when he was going back to his home from school, a couple in town invites Will and his family to the Christmas party. Will also says yes to them. In the meantime, we see two men who were keeping an eye on Will, but Will knew nothing about it. Now when he comes home, he gets a surprise in his house. His elder brother had come to his house for Christmas. As soon as he came, he shifted his stuff to Will's room. Because of this, Will now has to stay in the room above him. His mom gets a very big tree for Christmas, which the same two men had brought to Will's house, who were keeping an eye on him till now. They follow him everywhere. He knew a lot about Will, like his name and his birthday. Now they both wish Will a happy birthday, because today was Will's birthday. But he was a little surprised. He thinks, how does a stranger know about me? Still, he does not pay attention to this thing. Now one of them tells Will that the weather is going to be bad. But outside, the weather was absolutely clear. No one was taking Will's birthday seriously here. Only Will's sister gives him a gift, which was a watch. Will is very happy to see it. His sister puts a watch on him and says that today is your birthday. Come on, make a wish. A wish that you want to fulfill. Will says yes, I want to see snowfall. Meanwhile, Will's elder brother gets a video call. Who had gone abroad to study? His brother had sent him a lot of Christmas gifts. Will has an old belt. Seeing this, he becomes sad. When everyone was asleep, Will saw snow was falling at his house at night. The surprising thing was that it was only at Will's house. Seeing this, he was very happy, and he thinks that his birthday wish has been fulfilled. The next day, he goes to get a Christmas gift for his sister, where two police officers stop him, and they say that we suspect you. You have stolen. They had taken him to the police station for questioning. Those police officers were asking him a lot of strange questions. They ask him about signs and marks. Will sees that everything is happening strangely. Then suddenly, a police officer turns into a strange creature. Will was scared to see all this. He tries to run away from here. Then those two police officers came to catch him, but Will removes them both at once, which was quite surprising. Then Will somehow saved his life and ran away from there. After this, we are shown the party scene in Will's town. There, Will met a schoolgirl who had suddenly disappeared. Her name was Maggie. She and the same two men meet, who were keeping an eye on her. Will's brother talks to Maggie at the party, because of which Will was jealous. Somewhere, Will started liking Maggie. That's why he goes out of the house for a while to walk. Then a strange man was sitting on a horse there. He was after him. He also asks about Will's sign, like the police officer was asking him. Now, which sign was this? What sign were these people talking about? We will come to know this in the story. He also tries to kill Will. Then an old lady, her assistant, and the same two strangers came there, who were still following Will. Now they tell that rider to go away from there, and save Will. The rider going away tells them that for the next five days darkness will be darkness. That means there will be darkness everywhere. Saying this, he went away. Will was not understanding anything. What is happening with him? Now that lady and all the others will with the help of magic, they travel through time, and take them to a beautiful jungle, where there was a very big palace. Here is what the lady tells Will, that the rider can't come here until until someone calls him from himself, means you are safe here. That reason tells Will that we are the old ones. Light spreads light. Many years ago, light and darkness between darkness and light, there was a very big fight, in which light won. He defeated the darkness, but did not finish. Now we have come back to end that darkness, and to finish the darkness, we need some signs, which are six in number. With their help, darkness can be finished. The meaning of those signs is in a book, which only a seeker can read, and not anyone else. Will you be? You are the one who can find those signs. You are our seeker. Will was going to get his powers, when he was fourteen years old. Now, when Will was fourteen years old, he had his powers. Will can do anything, like snowfall. That's why the people of darkness became the enemy of Will's life. That rider was from the world of darkness. That's why he wanted to kill Will. Will said that the seeker Will will be the seventh son of his parents. Will says that I am the sixth of his siblings, so how can I be a seeker? Now all this is to convince Will, that he should help them. The lady shows him a crystal ball, in which Will sees that if darkness is not stopped, then how will the whole world be destroyed? Will came back to his house, when he was resting in his room. Then suddenly, while getting up, his foot slips. Will did not want to go to the doctor, 
So his mom calls the doctor at home. The doctor was none other than the rider of the world of darkness who was the enemy in Will's life, who now comes to meet Will in the form of a doctor. He again asks Will about science, and he also cured his foot. But when Will does not say anything, then he did it again. Does the same to his foot and leaves. At night, Will gets a picture of his room, which was his. But along with that picture, his twin brother was also there. Now Will asks his mom about all this. She tells him that he is your twin brother, who was born to you some time ago. But someone kidnapped him. We searched for him a lot, but we did not find him anywhere. Here's what Will came to know. That he is the seventh among his siblings, and he is the seeker. Will now travel back in time, and again reaches the same jungle. His foot was also cured. Here is what the lady's assistant tells him. That you can read those signs. They are very powerful. You will find out soon. That's where they are. That means they are very powerful. You can understand everything. And with your powers, you can use your brain. You can go from one place to another. Yes, you just can't fly. Although Will also wanted this power inside him, now he uses his power, and starts reading the books of the old ones, and now tells him about the sign. Then he sees one of his lockets. Now we see at church, where a lot of people were sitting and praying. Will had also reached there through time travel. Actually, he had come back many years ago, where all the old warriors also reach. Here, a very old woman comes to them who suddenly attacks them with snakes. Everyone was stuck under those snakes, but Will somehow gets out of there, and from a pole lying there, he also takes out the second sign. On the other side, we see the rider, who does not know anyone, but he does not know anyone. On the other side, we see the rider, who was telling someone, that Will has also got the second sign. Will's brother was with Maggie at home. Will also comes here. He talks to Maggie. Maggie does magic on him, Will felt that he was also one of the old ones, meaning one of the people who spread light. Maggie says, no, I am like you. Will also return his scarf to him, which he got from the bus. Then Will's brother comes here, who insulted Will and took Maggie with him. Will gets very angry about this. He goes out and shouts so loudly, that a tree caught fire. Now Will's sister also sees all this. Before this, Will used to explain something to him. Suddenly, the weather was bad. Now he was going to take his sister inside. At that time, after a wrong time travel, Will came to a place with his sister, where there was a war. Here, some warriors catch him, and threw him in the water. Will was very worried about his sister. He also gets the third sign there, which was made on a shield. The warrior who had that shield he likes Will's watch very much. Will makes a deal with that warrior. I will give you my watch. You gave me your shield. Now here he also got the third sign. He takes it and comes back home. After time travel with his sister. We see the rider, who was shouting at someone. That Will has also found the third sign. You have not been able to do anything yet. He tells him to find the remaining sign. The town also started snowing suddenly. Here, his brother comes to meet Will, who was under the control of the rider. He asks him about the remaining signs, where he does not tell him anything. Then there was a fight between the two. They reach an old hotel after time travel, where people were fighting for chickens. Meanwhile, Will also gets the fourth sign from here. Now he takes it, and after time travel again, came back home. Here, Will hits his brother hard. Will also gets the fourth sign. Here, Will also hits his brother hard, which made him unconscious. Now, when he comes to his senses, the rider's control also ends. Will gets all four signs. He puts them all on the same belt, which his brother gave him as a gift on Christmas. There, the rider goes to those unknown people, who attacks them with spears. We are not shown. Whether they are alive or dead there was a storm everywhere. There was darkness everywhere. The rider somehow wanted to get those signs, which were with Will. Then the same unknown man comes to the rider, whom he told to find the sign. The rider tells him that those signs are with Will. You have to bring them to me. If you do this, then I will also fulfill my promise. I will make you young forever. And here we come to know. That unknown man was none other than Maggie, which was a witch. And because of the rider's power, she was so young. The rider had brought a storm everywhere. It was snowing. Water fills everything. Here Maggie asks Will about the sign. Then Will also sees the fifth sign. Without telling Maggie, he also gets the sign. Maggie was shouting at him a lot. When Will sees him shouting like this, then he also came to know. Maggie is also one of his enemies. So now he gets the sign and pushes Maggie into the water. When she goes to the rider, the rider got angry. He changed Maggie into an old woman and left her to die in the water. Now Will again goes with the old ones, to their palace, 
where the rider could not come by his own will, now he takes out the voices of Will's family, and emotionally blackmails him, in which he also succeeded, he comes there with the help of Will, and imprisons all the old ones, in the world of darkness, and asks Will for the sign, when Will refuses, with the help of the crystal ball, he shows off his twin brother, who was seen in the picture by Will, who was kidnapped as a seeker, the rider was also going to take Will into the darkness, then he remembers, that the last sign is a soul, which is himself, Will now uses his power, defeats the rider, and he changed him into a crystal ball with his power, as soon as he did this, all the old ones were freed from the world of darkness, with whom Will's brother was also freed, Will sees his brother for the first time, who was exactly like him, and now he was free, he comes home with him, everyone was very happy to see them, Will's brothers were living together, his mom is very happy to see everyone, similarly, Will had finished the world of darkness, forever. And with this, this story ends here.